Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Rick Arino here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Brawl Stars Reddit page. In specific, we're going to be looking at their artwork. I'm going to be judging them, assessing them, in general, just appreciating the work that people have put into it. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. My first try, give me tips. How can I become better? Okay, so right now we have a drawing of Max, the brand new icon from Epiphany. Honestly, it's pretty close to the actual real icon. Not bad at all, nice job. Although he could probably spice it up a little bit more, but overall, I like it a lot. Not a map idea. A brawlified, zombified, BB-fied, mapified, Minecraftified map arc of zombie BB, but in Minecraft. For a second, guys, I thought this was gonna be in, um, what's it called, the map maker once again, um, when you look from afar, but hey, it's from Minecraft, and anyways, it looks absolutely amazing. Love the title of it, a brawlified, zombified, BB-fied. Pretty, pretty darn dope. Is there anything on the second part? Looks like just another render or um, version of it. A couple of days late, but I created Pumpkin Sprout for Halloween. Okay, see, I was thinking about making some brawler on my pumpkins myself, but I kind of chicken out, not gonna lie, because I was like, there's no way I'm gonna be good enough to make them. But for this, oh my god, this sprout looks honestly sexy. It honestly looks hella nice. Um, really, really clean cuts, I'm not gonna lie. For me, I kind of struggled to make those crisp cuts that he did. Electric Amber Skin Concept by me. Electric Amber. Okay. Dude, I can honestly see where this guy's going with this. Like, there's so much potential to make Amber, like, skin so good looking and so worth the gems. Simply because, hey, like, her regular attack anima animation, my bad, with the flames is pretty, pretty darn huge. And... I would honestly love to see Amber with different elements because that would just be really cool and make Amber a little bit of a spicy character if you know what I'm talking about. Honestly, that would just make her one of the most spiciest characters in the game and probably one of the spiciest legendaries. I present to you, Coralette. I am no artist, but as you can see, I drew with my club Penguin Pencil. Pretty dope game, but it got canceled, sadly. Uh, but the concept was cool. Oh my god, this actually reminds me of a movie, I forgot. Um, maybe some of you guys know what I'm talking about, that movie though with like the people who have eyes, who their eyes are like buttons and it's kind of a little bit creepy and it's kind of a classic. I forgot what it's called, but guys, this looks exactly like it and I could totally imagine Colette fitting in this world. Kind of really interesting, honestly. This is a 10 out of 10 art piece. My friend drew this. I'm scared. Oh my god, guys. That's Spike though. I can actually see this honestly in a horror game, literally chasing after you. What if this spike was actually the real form in Star Park? Imagine that. I drew Rosa. It took me over six hours. Okay, this art is actually insane. Did he draw this spike by hand? I'm assuming it is because of the texture and everything. Honestly, congrats to you for drawing this over six hours. That's, I wouldn't even be able to do that in like what, three days or something. I'm really bad at art, but honestly, 20 out of 10. BB fan art from my sketch. Okay, we got BB, heroine BB, um, a little bit different colored um, hats and little different eyes. Um, but overall, it's, it's nice, but nothing I'm too crazy about um, in my personal opinion. Next art. Skin idea slash edit steampunk Jesse. Okay, so we got like, you know, the cute hat. Honestly, that hat, those two like, uh, what's it called, wheels or... What are those things? Wheels, I'm guessing? They look like kind of like Carl's eyes. Maybe I'm tripping or something, but I can definitely see Carl for some reason. It reminds me of it. Is that... Huh. Overall, honestly, I, I thought this gun looked like a magnet for a second, but it's really, really cool. I decided to brawlify a famous Spongebob scene. Oh, boo-hoo. Let me play a sad song for you on the world's smallest violin. Poco? This is serious. Okay, we got the... M's and the Poco, you know, their affinity with one another. And he says, I know, this really is the world's smallest violin. See? Okay, okay. I like it, I like it. Honestly, the art is really well drawn. I love how it's like reacted from the SpongeBob scene. Furry Amber. Seriously? Why? Just why? Poco, but he's sporting another look. Call me XXX. Oh my god, are we going into the gender benders now? Oh my lord. Not a map idea. Brawloween Rosa, aka Sans Rosa. Okay, he actually made this in map editor? Yo, this guy is actually insane. 
Honestly, never thought about using maps to make brawl art, but I, I mean, I kind of did, but not in the same exact detailed way that this guy you slash paid BS did. Honestly, it's pretty insane, and I wonder how long this took him to make. Funny skin idea. Ratatouille Colette. Honestly, okay. Looks really, really smooth. The drawing is honestly pretty darn good. We got Colette, what for chef. Ratatouille is always going to be one of those classics, and every time I watch Gordon Ramsay, I always think about it. The Demonic Trio. Okay. Wait, did he draw this? Honestly, this looks so smooth if he did. You got the um, Demon Colette, Demon Bow, and also as well as Evo Jean. Lovely, lovely skins. All of them are pretty cool. Um, whoa, okay. We got Colette giving some affection to Spike. Um, Spike always wants those hugs. Um, just some of your... Wait. No, no, no. This is this is based on Kairos' theory that he's the father of both of them. I don't see it at all. Repost because I forgot to outline Jesse. So here we are. We have Jesse, as quote unquote, according to the author, she says Jess explains why she thinks she is so OP, but we all know she is not sadly. So she says, well, um, effing and chat Jesse. Imagine if Jesse was broken, guys. That would be absolutely no fun to play against at all. Thanks for watching to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you smash that like, comment, and subscribe button. That's all for today, and I'll see you soon.